And lastly, this is my final night at ABC 7 Fox 22. My first day was August 7, 2017, and I remember that day not because I wrote it in my calendar, but because this job has made me not only grow as a journalist, but also a person. Funny how much an area can impact you when you spend so much time alone in a studio field or even your basement talking to a camera. Anyway, Maine will forever be my second home. The sports community welcomed me with open arms from the start, even when I had to tell people my name wasn't Bub. Yeah, you get the point. All right, all the Sub-Zero nights filming outside, the championships, the hecklers in the student section, it's been fun. Storytelling is my passion, and as I've learned, Maine is full of inspirational people. Thank you to my coworkers who've been an extension of my family. I'll miss you dearly. The student athletes, coaches, athletic directors, parents, I can't thank you enough for entrusting us with your stories. And I am also thrilled to announce John Wagner will be taking over as sports director. He's going to do an absolutely fantastic job. Congratulations to him. And folks, take a minute and wish him well. If you see him out and about, his Canes did just get trounced by the Bruins. And it, it has been kind of funny because I did make that comment to him, Andrew, last night. It's like, you know, <laughs> your first day on the job as sports director in a New England-based community. And look, the Bruins handily <laughs> take away your canes and move them out quickly. And that has been rerun in the newsroom multiple <laughs> times since it's happened. Yeah, it's been run like four times, yeah. much to uh, John's delight. But uh, yeah, he's going to do an absolutely fantastic job. I just want to thank you guys too. You've been absolutely fantastic. Um, it's just, I know the pandemic has kind of put a damper on a lot of things and certainly yeah. tough times now, but it, it's been nice being back in studio, yeah. even though we are socially distanced apart. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys have been absolutely fantastic. I can't thank you enough. And uh, I'm sure we'll be staying in touch as we all move uh, our separate ways and continue our futures as well. That's right. Andrew and I started around the same time, so we've literally grown through together. And uh, um, we're really going to miss you here, Andrew. Best of luck in the future. I um, miss you guys too. Thanks. Being, being the uh, being the old timer in the room, <laughs> I you know seen. I, I've been here for all of five years. I mean, my former career in radio moved me over here five years ago. <laughs> but watching. Uh, Watching the uh, the little chicken nuggets, uh, as they're so delicately called in the newsroom, come in and gain uh, experience and watch them. Uh, you're going to do great things in the future, Andrew. I have all the respect in the world for you, so it's been a, been a pleasure, my friend. Appreciate it, JR. Right. And hey, that, that is all the time that we have for sports. We'll be right back after the break.